disciples of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Allah the Almighty said, وَمَنْ أَظْلَمُ مِمَّنِ افْتَرَى عَلَى اللَّهِ كَذِبًا أَوْ قَالَ أُوْحِيَ إِلَيَّ وَلَمْ يُوْحَى إِلَيْهِ شَيْءٍ وَمَنْ قَالَ سَأُنْزِلُ مِثْلِ مَا مَا أَنْزَلَ اللَّهُ وَلَوْ تَرَى إِذِ الظَّالِمُونَ فِي غَمَرَاتِ الْمَوْتِ وَالْمَلَائِكَةُ بَاسِطُو أَيْدِيهِمْ أَخْرِجُوا أَنْفُسَكُمْ الْيَوْمَ تُجْزَوْنَ عَذَابَ الْهَوْنِ بِمَا كُنْتُمْ تَقُولُونَ عَلَى اللَّهِ غَيْرَ الْحَقِّ وَكُنْتُمْ عَنْ آيَاتِهِ تَسْتَكْبِرُونَ الْأَنَامَ and who can be more unjust than who invents a lie against Allah or says, I have received inspiration, whereas he is not inspired in anything, and who says, I will reveal the lie of what Allah has revealed, and if you could but see when the uh, wrong doyers are in the agonies of death, while the angels are stitching forth their hands, saying, deliver you souls, this day you shall be uh, recompensed with the torment of degradation because of what you used to utter, utter against Allah the other than the truth and you use it to reject his signs with this respect. And said, قُلْ أَيُّ شَيْءٍ أَكْبَرُ شَهَادَةً قُلُ اللَّهُ شَهِيدٌ بَيْنِي وَبَيْنُكُمْ وَأُوحِيَ إِلَيَّ هَذَا الْقُرْآنَ لِأُنْذِرُكُمْ بِهِ وَمَنْ بَلَغَ أَنَّكُمْ لَتَشْهَدُونَ أَنَّ مَعَ اللَّهِ آلِهَةً أُخْرَى قُلْ لَا أَشْهَدُ قُلْ إِنَّمَا هُوَ إِلَاهُ وَاحِدُ وَإِنَّنِي بَرِيءٌ مِمَّا تُشْرِكُونَ أَلَا نَعَمْ Say Muhammad, what thing is the most great in witness? Say, Allah the most great is witness between me and you. This Quran has been revealed to me that I may therewith warn you and whomsoever it may reach. This means that Allah is witness over all that is happening and that he's the greatest witness. He's watching over you and I concerning all that was revealed from him. What makes these words even stronger is that they imply in solemn uh, of uh, from the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him in that Allah sent him to all creation to warn them through his Quran whoever received the message is considered to have received the warning as Allah the Almighty said وَمَنْ يَكْفُرُ بِهِ مِنَ الْأَحْزَابِ فَالنَّارُ مَوْعِدُهُ فَلَا تَكُنْ فِي مَرِيَّةٍ مِنْهُ إِنَّهُ الْحَقُّ مِنْ رَبِّكْ وَلَكِنَّ أَكْثَرَ النَّاسِ لَا يؤمن الهود. But those of the sex Jews, Christians, and all the other non-Muslim nation, nations that reject in the Quran, the fire will be their promised meeting place. So be not in doubt about it. Verily, it is the truth from your Lord, but most of mankind believe not. The Quran contains all truthful information regarding Allah, his angels, his throne, and his upper and lower creatures. It also includes knowledge about the heavens and the earth, and all that is between them, as well as the, uh, all the great events taking place therein, supported by decisive evidence, which is to be con uh, conceived by the sound mind, as Allah the Almighty says, وَلَقَدْ صَرَّفْنَا لِلنَّاسِ فِي هَذَا الْقُرْآنِ مِنْ كُلِّ مَثَلٍ فَأَبَى أَكْثَرُ النَّاسِ إِلَّا كَفُورَ سُرْتِ الْإِسْرَى And indeed, we have fully explained it to mankind in this Quran every kind of similitude, similitude but must mankind refuse the truth and accept nothing uh, but disbelieve. Allah the Almighty also said وَتِلْكَ الْأَمْثَالُ نَضْرِبُهَا لِلنَّاسِ وَمَا يَعْقُلُهُ إِلَّا الْعَالِمُونَ الْأَحْبُوت and this uh, similitoid uh, we put for, forward for mankind, but none will understand them except uh, those who have knowledge of Allah and His signs, etc. And said, وَلَقَدْ ضَرَبْنَا لِلنَّاسِ فِي هَذَا الْقُرْآنِ مِنْ كُلِّ مَثَلٍ لَعَلَّهُمْ يَتَذَكَّرُونَ قُرْآنًا عَرَبِيًّا غَيْرَ ذِي عَوَجٍ لَعَلَّهُمْ يَتَّقُونَ الزُّمْرَ And indeed, we have put forth for men in this Quran every kind of similitude in order that they may remember an Arabic Quran without any crookedness uh, therein in order that they may avoid all evil which Allah has ordered them to avoid fear him and keep their uh, duty to him the glorious Quran also tells us the truth concerning the events that happened in the past and evidence by what was written in the books of the people of the scriptures, Jews and Christians themselves, even though 
the Quran was revealed to an illiterate man. This man never witnessed any of the events of the previous nations or read any of their books. Nevertheless, he surprised people by what was revealed to him of those events that are mentioned so that people can take lessons from the stories of the previous prophets with their nations how they suffered with them and how allah the almighty saved the believers and destroyed the unbelievers these stories were revealed uh, to the prophet muhammad peace be upon him in a language with uh, with which nothing can compare stories are told briefly but using very um eloquent uh, and will versed language the same story is told again in other places but in detail with the same uh, superb linguistic structures the one who reads or hears these verses of the quran feels as if he is watching the sun uh, live uh, being present in the midst of events as they are unfolding allah the almighty said وما كنت بجانب الطور إذ نادينا ولكن رحمة من ربك لتنذر قوما ما آتاهم من نذير من قبلك لعلهم يتذكرون قصص and you all Muhammad were not at the side of the tour mount when we did call but you are sent as a mercy from the Lord to be warning to a people to whom no warner had come before in order that they may remember or receive um, a diminution and said ذلك من أنباء الغيب نوحيه إليك وما كنت لديهم إذ يلقون أقلامهم أيهم يكفل مريم وما كنت لديهم إذ يختصمون آل عمران you were not with them when they, ca- when they cast lots with their pins as to which of them should be charged with the care of Maria Mary nor were you with them when they disported Allah um, glorified be he also said in Surah Yusuf, ذلك من أنباء الغيب نوحيه إليك وما كنت لديهم إذ أجمعوا أمرهم وهم يمكرون وما أكثر الناس ولو حرصت بمؤمنين وما تسألهم عليه من أجر إن هو إلا ذكر للعالمين. This is of the news of the unseen which we reveal by inspiration to you. You were not present with them when they arranged their plan together and also why they were plotting and most of mankind will not believe even if you desire to uh, eagerly and no reward um, reward you ask of them for it it the quran is no less than a reminder and an advice into the men and jinn until he says at the end of surah لقد كان في قصصهم عبرة لأولي الألباب ما كان حديث يفترى ولكن تصديق الذي بين يديه وتفصيل كل شيء وهدى ورحمة لقوم يؤمنون The following is an example also He knows that there will be some among you sick others traveling through the land seeking of Allah's bounty yet others fighting in Allah's cause علم أن سيكون منكم مرضى وآخرون يضربون في الأرض يبتغون من فضل الله وآخرون يقاتلون في سبيل الله This was one of the very first chapters that were revealed in مكة There is another example mentioned in سورة القمر The Moon which was also revealed in مكة with no dispute among the scholars as to the place of its revelation سيهزم الجمع ويولون الدبر فللساعة موعدهم والساعة أدها وأمر Their multitude will be put to fight and they will show their backs Nay, but the hour is their appointed time and the hour will be more grievous and more bitter The defeat mentioned here was that of one of the non-believers which actually took place in the battle of Badr later on